In this video of Microsoft Azure Cloud Platform, we are going to discuss about creating a cloud SQL data warehouse. To do this, log into your Microsoft Azure and click on New and click on Databases and select SQL Data Warehouse. In the database names, enter an, a name BD PS SQL subscription, depending upon your subscription type. Resource group would be your default resource group. Here you can have a source as blank database or a sample or a backup. For now, we'll keep blank select the server i already have a server created but when you create it for the first time you have to create a new server enter any server name what you wish to bdcs sql that will be your server name dot database dot windows dot net set up a user id and password And select a location. I'm not going to select it, but when you click on select, it's going to create a server like this. Once created, you can select the performance type. More the DW use, the more will be the USD per hour rate. So I'm going to keep it to the minimum or depending upon your need. Click on Team to Date Dashboard and click on Create. Please note that to create a data warehouse, it's going to take some time for it to be enabled. I already have created as I mentioned earlier. So I'm going to go to my dashboard and you can see an SQL data warehouse already created. You can load the data or you can use this connection string to connect to from JDBC, ODBC or a PHP connector. Now here please note that this is the data warehouse but the underlying data database server SQL server is this 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 is where we you want to go this is your SQL data warehouse and this is your SQL server this is the place where you have your server ADM and the resource group Everything available. So SQL Data Warehouse is built on top of this SQL Server, which is PDCS SQL One. So you can use this SQL Server to store the database, uh, in the, the tables in the databases. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to connect it using SQL Server Management Studio. Thank you for watching.